Hey, got a smoke? I do, the kind you like. Now where's the amber? Unfortunately, it's not on me at the moment. And you really should be telling me what a good job I did. Busted my ass and managed to hide it right before I got caught. Which is why I'm still alive. The deal was, we get you out of here when you deliver the amber. No amber, no protection, Luis. <laughs> Such a stickler for details, Hyde. Okay, then. I'll go get it now, how about that? And I do have something else I need to get, too. This is Roost. I've got some bad news, Condor One. With the weather like this, the chopper can't make its approach. Can you stand by until it clears? Negative. Too dangerous. We're gonna get out of here and find someplace safe. I'm sorry. I wish I could do more to help. Don't worry about it. We'll swim home if we have to. Condor 1, out. How's it going, Let's everyone? Go. Lucian what's, Sword here. What's gonna happen to me? Right now. Let's just focus on getting out of here. Yeah. Right. Oh, I think you know what's gonna happen, actually. You're gonna turn into one of those freaks. By the way, guys, if you didn't notice, I switched back to regular costumes. Although, I did give Ashley a pair of glasses. I also unlocked a new accessory for her to change her hair to be red. Like, it looks the same as it does, except red. Um, not sure if I want to use it, but let me know if you guys want to see that. But I thought the glasses looked pretty good on her. And I wanted to do at least one episode where we're in, you know, regular clothes. And I also realized that if you take the jacket off of Ashley, she actually pretty much is wearing what she wore in the original. Which I didn't even <laughs> catch that at first. But yeah, she's just wearing a really nice jacket and the scarf is a bit different. Her hairstyle is different. But yeah, still the same old Ashley we, we know and love. Alright, so I'm actually replaying this chapter literally for the fourth time. Long story short, um, just the, I did record it previously, but the recording had so much lag uh, during certain parts that I decided I just... Wanted to tinker with the graphic settings until I could finally figure out what was causing the lag. And I think I did. So the graphics should still look really good. And it should not lag nearly as bad as it did. Like on the boss fight at the end of this chapter, it lagged so bad that the entire boss fight was frozen pretty much in the video. Like literally over a minute or two of just froze. So I didn't want to put you guys through that. And I, you know, I just wanted to fix the issue basically. I hear, I hear something, I don't see it, there it is. Uh, this is going to be a fun episode though. Uh, I've actually done it a few times like I said and I don't even mind doing it again. That's how much I like this chapter, so let's go ahead and... I know he has new items. There we go, so we're basically all out of ammo from the last episode cutting us off before we could even loot. Hate when the game does that. And not only that, but there's not only one, but two boss fights in this uh, episode. Thankfully, there's a lot of loot that we can pick up, so it's not gonna be that big of an issue. Um, just heal up and everything. All right. Gun rock. Welcome. I got something so he has new a new gun. Them. And it is a better shotgun, the riot gun. You get some bang for your buck, I guarantee it. Oh, we'll get some bang for our buck. This actually has a tighter bullet spread, so it doesn't hit as wide of a range, but it's it's just better in every other way. So let's go ahead and sell the W8870. <laughs> go ahead and buy the riot gun. Ah, that there's a real boomstick. Your target to a bloody I thought he was going to say it's a real banger, but he said it's a real boomstick. <laughs> Let's repair the knife. We're going to need it. Upgrade this. 
And uh, yeah. There you are. As you. We might not have any money, can, but we're gonna get the. Will look great with that attached. The red nine stock. We're gonna get that. It'll attach to our pistol and make it a lot easier to aim. And let's go ahead and get the gunpowder as well. <laughs> Come back any and don't forget to actually attach the stock to the red nine. It doesn't do it automatically. And that is the riot gun. It actually looks a little bit different. I actually think it looks more beat up in this one. Like there's like scratches and stuff on it. The original Resident Evil 4 riot gun I think looked a little bit cooler. But oh well. Hopefully this one's just as effective. Oh, we gotta actually set it to shortcut. Alright. Let's reload to get full capacity. Alright. Uh. Some more resources before we head to this next area. Uh, there's some rifle ammo I missed. I don't really care about TMP ammo. Maybe I should just sell it. Uh, not like I'm hurting on like inventory space. So for now, we'll just keep it. Alright, Ashley. You ready for this next section? Tighten the defenses. This is a direct order from Lord Sadler himself. Convert the area beyond this point into a defensive position so that no intruders may pass. I'm willing to make any and all sacrifices for the sake of the righteous faith. My devout believers, build me an impregnable fortress and make sure any heathen foolish enough to trespass pays for their wicked sins in blood. Ooh. -hoo. So you're telling me this is like super defended? Well, we're about to test those defenses. See if we can impregnate them, right, Ashley? Right? Wink, wink. Just kidding. Just kidding. Okay, let's go. What? They said it was an impregnable defense. All right. Uh, let's go at this a little bit stealth, at least at first. Okay. We're going to stealth this guy. There's only four guys right here, but if any of the four guys sees you, they're going to raise the alarm and summon a lot more enemies. Ashley, I actually want you to just get in the corner over here. Let's just push you... Push you back here. Back up. And then you just stay right there, okay? Let Big Daddy Lucian take care of the enemies, as per the usual. Couple shots. Should take care of her. Ashley, stay crouched. Just because I stand up does not mean that you can stand up, okay? Now, this guy's going to come investigate over here. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. He's going to raise the alarm, but whatever. Maybe we can shank him before he does. Nope, guess not. All right, Ashley, you might want to run. Can you please raise your weapon, Leon? Thank you. Come on, guys. Ashley, get over here. Why are you going towards the enemy? Do you have a death wish? You gotta be kidding me, Ashley. Let's kill the big guy. Y'all need to leave my girlfriend alone. Ashley, I told you to hide in that corner, and what did you do? You, what are you doing, Ashley? Are you suicidal? Hold still. Okay, I'm hitting the button. And it's not doing anything. Okay, should be good. Thanks. Luckily, the guys up there only take a few shots. Ashley, Ashley are you? <sighs> she is very suicidal, guys. You gotta be careful for that. Come on. Just stay with me, Ashley. No All right. I'm not going to tell you to hide anymore because apparently that means the opposite to you. So from now on, just stay close. All right. Let's get all the loot. Got an emerald from that big guy. Unfortunately, we used the flashbang, but I mean, we can just craft another one probably. Which I do recommend. And I would love to craft more shotgun shells. But we do need pistol ammo as well, so screw it. Let's just do that. All right. Wait, did I get that treasure? Yes, we did. All right. 
there's a few more items to loot in here and you definitely want to loot everything you can because like I said more than one boss fight in this chapter some more ooh, a hand grenade that's always good and I think we got all the loot so let's just keep going there, there's a couple more crates and then there's a there's a shack oh gosh I saw that too late there's a shack up here that we want to go into with one enemy inside, but it has really good loot. So you don't want to miss it. Got some shotgun shells. Nice. Definitely want those. But yeah, um... I don't know. I was kind of thinking about using the villain costume for Leon next episode. Don't know if I want to change Ashley's costume. But if I do, it'll be back to romantic. I didn't really like that punk costume she had going on and the other she she gets other costumes but uh, you have to unlock them by like completing the game on hard and stuff like that all right here's the shack i'm talking about there's actually a guy in here You're serious. four shots in the head with that and he is dead and like i said good loot in here don't want to miss it the Chalice of Atonement, which can be socketed a few times. Maybe even four times. I don't remember. Let's check. So, we can socket this with our yellow diamond. That's good. And then this has three sockets. So, let's just do one of each color. I think that actually does a bonus. It's a little bit of a bonus. If you had three of the same, it would be a little bit better, but oh well. So we can sell for a lot of money at this point. We're doing all right on health. Would be nice if our health just like regenerated automatically over time, but nah, it doesn't. Uh, one final thing, guys. If you are trying to get all of the Clockwork Castle Inn statues, there is one right there. There's one in each chapter, so that's the one that is in Chapter 6. I already got it in my other playthrough, <laughs> my other multiple playthroughs of this zone. Ashley just staring at the back of my head. What are you looking at, Ashley? Oh, miss these barrels. So this next area just has like a few stragglers in it, just like three or four guys. And there's also a bunch of loot in the area. So just spend some time, pay attention to where the hanging lanterns are, but don't shoot them yet. Sure is quiet. Spend some time looking around, making sure you pick up any loot that you see. Um, this is the door we're gonna go through. It looks like I need something. We need to get the crank first. Which, you guessed it, we gotta fight a boss, kind of. It's like a mini boss. Could have sworn there was some loot in these crates or whatever those are. On top oh, here it is. Right there. And there's something hanging right there. Oh, come and get me. Another spinel. Oh hi. Thank you for running to me. Save me a little bit of time there. Yeah, no, you're dead. Ooh. Hi. Nice to meet you too. Come and find me. Hide and seek. Count to ten first. Grab some hand. Oh, wow, you're fast. Might be like one or two more guys, but before we even worry about any more guys, let's just keep looting and looting and looting. Um, there's also a hanging lantern right there. That's not the same as the other one. There's two hanging lanterns in this area. You don't have to know where both of them are, but it is wise to keep track of where they are. All right, now let's go up the stairs. A few more areas to loot. Ashley, please stop panting so loudly. You're like acting like you are so out of shape. We're like barely even moving. Come on. We're just kind of brisk walking every now and then. Look at that. And not even for very lo very far. So let's go into this building. There's the herb. And let's go all the way through the building to our final way shrine cabinet. Remember when I said we weren't going to need the way shrine key anymore? 
Yeah, I lied. This time we won't need it anymore. After this. This is our final way shrine item. Okay. Back in the building and before we go downstairs, let's go this way. Just a few more items to do. And then we're going to fight the boss. Let's go down here. That door was locked, so this is the only way you can get these barrels is if you drop down right here. And just a little bit of handgun ammo and a velvet blue. Though it does open up another escape route right here. Which, if you don't want to blast an enemy to get through that door, which the enemy will come through once we start the boss fight, uh, we could go through the side door that we just opened. Alright, now we're ready to fight the boss. So, strategy for this boss fight... Um... Let's make an ultimate potion. Basically, can I craft a shotgun? No. Okay. So we're going to start the boss fight in that building. And then as soon as we can, we're going to come out the store and run up this pathway so that we can funnel a bunch of the enemies right here and just kind of hit them all at once. And then after we do that, we're going to run around and try to find those hanging lanterns and drop them on the bosses. And yes, there's two bosses. Before we fight the boss, let's tell Ashley to go in the locker. Wait here. What? You heard me. Okay. Do you want to die? You need to go. Yes, thank you. You don't have to tell her to go in there, but I recommend it. There's also another locker down here, right there. And then last but not least, first aid spray. And now we're ready to fight the boss. I'm actually going to do this. And uh, you'll see why in a minute. I only have one more of those. I'm going to save it for the next boss. Here we go. Nice backflip. Great. I should be able to take their chainsaw and use it. Sorry, didn't realize it was yours. I am flattered. <laughs> <laughs> they just exploded. Alright, he busts through that door for us. Let's go up the stairs, like I said. Don't worry about these guys too much. Oh, look at that. They're starting on fire. Beautiful. How about new shotgun? Alright. Before they get too close, let's just run away here. Also, in the previous recording, like, anytime I shot the shotgun, it would lag really badly. So if it's not lagging right now, I fixed it, basically. Um, I'm not even going to really worry about the tentacle guy. Let's drop down here because we're going to set him on fire if we can. Look at all of them. Yeah, you guys enjoy that. Oh, hi. I see you took a shortcut. Hello. Let's go over to the other hanging lantern over here. Slow down. I want you to kind of group up a little bit. Right this way. You are the next contestant on Get Flamed. Come on. Come on. Slow down. Alright, let's get out of here. Ow! I was trying to shoot and it would not shoot. Let's eat that fish. I'm actually saving a lot of ammo because I'm not really... Oh, I should have used this. Ow. Back off. Back off. Anyone else want some? Oh, we got the crank back. 
We actually killed both of the girls, so. Only got one of these, or, oh hi. Couple weak guys left. I need to find my bolts. Out of the way. Not nah, you're gonna get knife. Oh, thank you for just burning up for me. Come on up, guys. Come on up. <laughs> Fight. Y'all are too easy. What are you doing, buddy? Are you the last one? <laughs> Probably. Yep. All right. And as soon as you kill them all, Ashley will automatically get out of the locker and come find you. So don't even worry about her. All right. Um, that was pretty easy. Uh, like I said, as long as you kind of know what to do and game plan ahead. I mean, you don't have to lay that mine uh, for them to walk into but if you don't have any mines I would just throw a frag like as soon as they spawn or a flashbang then run up here like I did where are all my bolts we gotta look around a little bit cuz I'm sure one of these guys died and wherever they died that's where all my bolts are I, I dropped down here right just gonna retrace my steps a little bit I mean I know I could just actually I can look on the map right Ah, over there. Okay. Thank goodness the bolts actually appear on the map. It saves me a lot of time from, like, looking for them. So, they're over here. Oh, yeah, where I dropped this lantern. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Well, that's not all my bolts, but we got some handgun ammo as well. Must have missed a few shots. Where's all my... I thought I had more bolts than that. All right, whatever. I guess not. Let's craft... I still can't craft shotgun. Well, let's just do handgun then. We gotta work with what we got, you know? Alright, so... It's actually not much further, and then we're gonna fight another boss. Where am I? Okay, this way. Ashley, you're panting so much. Alright, let's pop the crank in there. Are you hurt? No, I'm... I'm okay. Yes. You did well back there. You Seems did. this isn't your first time running from creeps. I can't tell if that's meant to be a compliment. You didn't really do anything. I'm just hitting on you. It's all good. Alright, let's go. Um. Okay, okay, okay. So, this next area is um I died like three or four times on my first attempt however every playthrough since then I haven't died once because I know what to do so let me help you guys out if you don't know what to do let's jump in here come on Ashley basically the next boss is going to be chasing us and you cannot get caught or you get game over. Ashley cannot get caught or it's game over. Um, that's what kept happening to me. I wasn't really dying. It's just Ashley kept getting abducted and that causes a game over. Um, so basically... Most of the enemies you just want to run by and not really engage too much. Um, you can shoot them like once or twice and they'll probably die. You can also throw a flashbang, which is highly recommended at the start of the chase. And here we go. All right. Come on. Okay.
Ashley, take one of my guns. Requires cleansing. My soul doesn't require cleansing. You don't even have a soul anymore, bro. You're a bug now. Come, child. Ashley, run. You're a bug disguised as a human. <laughs> Hurry. Run, Ashley. Like your life depends on it, because it does. Run in here really, really fast and grab the flashbang and then run straight out again. Chuck the flashbang. Come, Ashley. Come, come, come. Ashley, are you crazy? Okay. Ignore Ashley and just keep running. She should make it. Oops. Okay, well, I uh, accidentally blew Ashley up. Otherwise, we were doing great. Let's try that again. Like I said, it's, it's not really from me dying. It's always Ashley. She's just not the best at, like, avoiding danger. All right, let's just skip it this time. Hurry. Ashley, stay by me. Move, Ashley. Let's go. Don't worry about that. Try to grab the loot if you can. Ashley, come on. This time I'll try not to blow you up. This way. <laughs> Sayonara, sucker. Close one. What's the matter? Can't jump over here? <sighs> Ashley, you tried really hard to die back there, you know that? But you didn't, so I'm proud of you for Listen, You're the one he wants. If we see him again. You run. What about you? I'll do my job. Let me do my job, lady. And Leon, she literally was running. It's just that he grabbed her like instantly so she couldn't run because apparently Leon wasn't protecting her well enough. Just saying. He trying to blame her, but I'm the one who's supposed to be Ooh. protecting. Breaks over, I suppose. Yeah, breaks over and I got a lot to sell. Welcome. What can I interest you in? Sell the key, the elegant headdress, some velvet blues, the chalice, the bangle. Do you much good in and now we're rich. Ooh, Repair I'll the knife. Easy fully upgrade the shotgun if you haven't we're already. To get an idea of your tastes, There's really nothing else I need at this point, so... Will that be all? Don't get yourself killed now. <laughs> Don't plan on it. Um, let's just save... Down here. This is uh, basically right before the next boss. Like I said, it's kind of a short chapter, and um, that's why I didn't mind replaying it. So, all right, let's make sure we're ready for this boss fight. I would like some more bolts, but whatever. Pretty much as soon as we walk over there, the boss fight's going to trigger. I'm pretty sure he knocks me over there and that's where we're fighting and he's gonna be standing like right here about so let's throw one of those down there i think that's about where he'll be ashley you're just gonna have to run and hide for a bit you probably want to have full health before you start the fight just so you know can i craft any shotgun yes that's what i really wanted all right. Other than that, this boss fight is a, it looks a lot harder than it is. Leon! 
That hurt. You want her? Go through me. Cease your pointless struggling. Abandon your body to the will of our God. You're a shitty missionary. You know that. Oh, Almighty. Grant me the strength to crush your enemies. Show us your true form. Come on. Ashley, run! Okay. Hustle away, go. Baby. God, I thank you for your gift. You want to get ugly? Let's get ugly. Oh, look at that. Ooh, nice hit on the mine, dummy. Watch out for that one. You should have known you were one of the bugs. Oh, yeah, he's definitely buggy. Um, Before I even worry about fighting him, I just want to, like, get the loot. Ah, uh, if he grabs you, just knife him. Not a big deal. Let go of me, bro. Can't you see I'm looting? I'll start the boss fight in a minute. Oh, thank you. You broke the crate for me. Actually, um, let's just heal up with the egg. Okay. Hey, buddy. Can't hurt me. Let me get all the loot up here. No, we don't. Ooh, miss me. Pathetic. I don't want to use all my knife because it is... Miss me. You move quick, such a big bastard. Let go of me. There goes my knife. You didn't need to do that. Miss me. I don't think he can even hurt me when I'm going up the ladder. You are the pitiful one. Death from above! I got plenty of kitchen knives, bro. And I will use them to kill you. Just keep running back and forth, basically. Yeah, I didn't want to guard it. I could have. I just didn't want to waste the knife. Miss me. Ooh, I hit him in the eyeball. Ooh. Show us your second form. Ooh, scorpion arms. I like it. Yeah, like the fire and stuff, it was causing my video to lag terribly. The game wasn't lagging, but like I couldn't even look at him right here. It was lagging so bad. So if it's not... Like, when I say bad, it was literally froze, the video, this entire boss fight. So, if it's not frozen right now... That means... I fixed it. Oh, really? That was your idea? Pick up some gas barrels? Not very smart. Come over here, fight me! Or just keep throwing stuff at me, you know, I don't really care. Running out of options, huh? Yeah, you're just gonna keep throwing stuff at me or come get me, buddy. Miss me. Oh, that was not a smart move. Quit picking up those barrels. Over here. Riot gun. OP. Pathetic.
You don't say! Actually, the only thing you're good for is escapes. Uh, Mendez's false eye. Give my regards to your god. Okay. Uh, actually, you can chill because I want to make sure I didn't miss any loot. Mm. Do, 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 do. Don't see any loot. Okay. Uh, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Come on. For what? Thanks. Patting the little fire out? This fire's bound to catch their attention. Let's keep moving. Uh, Leon, I'm not gonna turn into one of them, right? Probably. I won't let that happen. I promise. Ashley, you say you're welcome when I just 1v1'd the boss, the village chief. Like, just give me a little bit of credit there. Let's craft some more bolts. Bolts, bolts, bolts. And shotgun shells? And I cannot. Okay. Okay. Um, that was the boss. Not too hard if you just dodge his attacks. Even if you get hit a few times, really not a big deal if you have healing items, which I do. I mean, honestly, if you don't use the healing items, they just take up space in your inventory, right? So you might as well use them. Picking up the loot on the bottom part of that boss fight is worth it, even if you get hit a couple times, you know what I mean? Alright, I think that's pretty much it for loot, guys. And now we are on to one of my favorite parts of the game, the castle. Um, the castle was actually, like, once we get inside the castle. I don't know if we'll be inside next episode, but once we get inside it, it was so cool. Uh, in in VR in the Oculus version of Resident Evil 4 it was so cool one of my favorite places what's going on well at least you don't have to worry about being followed come on looks a bit run down and overgrown but it's still a dope castle. All right, well, that is the end of chapter six, guys. Let's go ahead and save it. And it says we died, but I mean, technically, Ashley did, I didn't. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed. Please drop a like if you did, and let me know if you want me to change the costumes back to romantic, or if you want me to use villain on, on Leon, romantic on Ashley. Let me know in the comments below. This is Lucian Sword. Look forward to episode 7. Take it easy, friends.